<coughs> so this is very interesting case of multiple pregnancy and this is the cervix and you can see there are gestational sacs inside on the primary instance it looks like having a three sacs and moreover there is subcoronic hematoma present on this uh, part of the uterine cavity so we'll go one by one so this is the first gestational sac so we'll zoom in we will have a look so we can see the fetal pole is there and uh, it's secondary yolk sac alongside this then coming to the second gestational sac so this is again one secondary yolk sac and the fetal pole and within the same G sac I am also having we are also getting another secondary yolk sac and the secondary another fetal pole so it is basically one G sac with the one fetal pole this is another G sac with the two fetal poles this is one fetal pole this is other fetal pole and in and within the third gestational sac we are again having fetal pole and the gestational uh, secondary yolk sac is there so in total four fetal poles are visible so it's a quadruplet pregnancy and i will take all the measurements one by one crl and fhs and i will uh, report uh, each and every uh, fetal heart rate 